Thank you. I'd like to welcome up Mika Ronkainen and Maria Akko. Maybe I got that close. So, it looks amazing. No cows were harmed in the making of the show, we can say? No. They were not hardened. Okay, they died a natural, natural death. Okay, thank you. Um, so, I, I wanted to ask you about you know, the setting. It's this sort of small town in the Finnish Bible Belt, quite a religious community. Why was that setting something you wanted to explore and, and base the show in? Uh, the, the show is dealing with a uh, religious sect called Lestadianism, which actually exists in the northern Finland. They have a lot of uh, political and e economical power. And uh, this can be seen most clearly in, in small villages in the northern Finland. And so I think the small town there is for the sake of authenticity. We and want it to be true to reality. Do you know these kinds of towns? Did you research? You grew well, up? we do. We both grew up in a little village, which was a little bit like this fictional mm -hmm. Varjaka town. And we got used to classmates who are not allowed to watch TV or teenager mates who don't come to rock concerts. So this kind of a little bit strange rules were somehow something we got used to. So we somehow have accepted this culture and it's part of our culture too, even if we don't belong to a certain group. Yes, interesting. Um, and these are not your typical detectives either. Lara, Sana, Lari, Sana. Can you tell us a little bit about what makes each of them a, a unique character that it's a bit more complex? Ooh, well, well I, I suppose detectives are actually quite the same all around the world. So as detectives, they are not that atypical, but as human beings, yes. they, are, they are unique. <laughs> um, Lauri was born into a Lestadian family, into this religious sect, and uh, he, uh, he struggled with his sexuality in his teens. And uh, that's because being gay is not accepted in, in this community, or practicing gayness is not accepted. And uh, that's the reason he hasn't seen his family in 10 years. Whereas Sanna, she hasn't any problems when it comes to her sexuality. She enjoys life and jumps into bed whenever it's possible. And this causes some problems. Yes. As you Word can gets imagine. Out in a small town if you do that too, I think. Yes. yes. <laughs> As writers, for us, the, the, the uh, development of the characters and the mystery behind the characters is just as important as the crime story. Okay. Interesting. And you're going to be looking at doing a season two? Are you writing that now? We are developing it, yes. Okay. So what could, how could you take it further in season two? Any broad ideas yet? We are not taking it further. We are taking it backwards. Uh -huh. We have a plan that we will make a prequel. Oh. And it's already planted in there. So Exciting. But I can't tell you more about okay, that. Okay, that's all right. Well, good luck tonight. Thank you so much for being here. And Thank yes, you. best of luck with season two. Thank you. Oh. So we're